Hi, I'm Lee Kern for Spurred On. Now I'm a little bit tired, I've just got out of bed, but Spurred On have promised me a KFC if I go through every Premiership team and analyse their logos. So here we go. First up, Aston Villa, basically just a lion juggling a snowball. Chelsea, also got a lion. And this one's holding some kind of giant lollipop, but he's so stupid. He's licking his tail like an idiot. Bournemouth, got a man going to A&E because someone's glued a football to his head. As you can see, the Arsenal logo is a piece of <laughs> on a classic red background. It's a, it's a classic design, it's very striking, very memorable. Uh, the red really brings out uh, the color of um, and there, of course, beneath it is Arsenal's famous motto, uh, whinging <laughs> Newcastle. They got two deformed, crazy fish horse creatures that must have crawled out of the Tyne, and now they're worshipping some kind of monkey that lives inside a chess piece. Swansea, they basically got three bits of signal toothpaste and then someone smeared a kind of dirty protest in an S, which I, I guess just stands for <laughs> Watford, they've got a moose. Leicester City, they basically got a children's entertainer to do a face painting of a fox. Crystal Palace, some kind of eagle looking for its football, but it's so stupid it doesn't realise it's standing on it. West Ham, basically got a logo for some crazy golf putting range. There's your little clubs there, and a windmill feature to try and get the ball through. West Bromwich Albion have got some bird that looks like it's escaped from a Christmas card that my grandma would send. Sunderland, two lions molesting and trying to rub their penises onto some kind of container that contains God knows what. I don't know what goes on in Sunderland. Everton, it basically looks like the logo for a stable where they send horses and donkeys before they're put down. And there's their motto there. No satisfaction, no optimism. Norwich basically got a pigeon scooting around on a bowling ball. Christ, what a mess. Southampton. I mean, obviously this has been designed by a man in the midst of some kind of mental breakdown who's basically just put every single image in his head onto the page at the same time. It's basically the work of a troubled man following a troubled team. Now, Liverpool have got a bird wearing shorts trying to take home a stick it's found, but it can't because it's flanked by flames at what seems like the entrance to the worst nightclub in the world. Man City, they've got some kind of bird that's so ugly, it can't even fit its tongue into its own mouth. And it's so ashamed of the rest of its body that it's actually had to hide it behind some kind of blue Peter badge. Man United got some kind of devil taking a ton of ecstasy, so now it's got brain damage and is irritating everyone. So they've just given it some kind of fork to go and f off and play with in the garden. And what have we got? Spurs. A chicken. A chicken standing on a football. With the famous Tottenham Hotspur, and we're going to Wembley, marching behind our chicken. So anyway, I'm Lee Kern. You've been watching Spurred On. If you've enjoyed this video, make sure you share it with your friends and subscribe. Um, if you didn't like it, I'm sure you'll let me know what a you think I am in the comments section. Uh, I'm sure that will really bum me out today. But it's been lovely to, to chat with you. Um, have a lovely one. Goodbye. <laughs>